Hi guys, welcome back to King's Crimes and Ant Wild. In this video, we're going to be talking about our gold mountain minnows, just how they're all getting on and everything. I'd like to give a big shout out to Tyrus Tank Friends, Lazarus the Fish Boy, Keeping Fish Simple, and Daniel Keeping Fish. First, we're just taking a look at how all the plants are growing in the tank. That our crypt over there in the little like raised planter we've got inside the tank is just flourishing, growing really well. You can see some natans that have somehow got on top of their leaves but um, that's growing lovely. We've got, you can see the java fern all growing and there's a bit of moss, java moss down there as well. Um, and then we've got a valisonera growing in this corner, raised corner area as well which seems to be doing really well. Um, and the minnows are just, just swimming around enjoying themselves. There's lots of java ferns all around this front area which are doing well. Um, and then we've also got in this raised corner area is Java fans as well. Um, and there's some southern natans there as well. You can also see the Anubius nanas we've got in there as well too. And we've also got the more Java fans. And a lot of Java moss growing there as well. Um, doing really well down there. This, this end um, seems to be growing a lot faster than the other end um, and the front um, but overall all seems to be doing really nice and I'm really pleased with how the plants are growing um, this is obviously a front view of the tank you can see our little magnet cleaner um, we've um, just see how all the plants are taking off and everything they're not spread completely around the front end yet um, and I'm hoping they will do soon um, but overall seem to be doing really well and um, our minnows do seem to be pretty happy in there still they're all doing well, we haven't lost any minnows um, so we, we're really happy there and now you can just watch our minnows having a nice little swim around <laughs> change our minds towards the terrestrial enclosure inside the tank um, which we have our dairy cow isopods in at the moment um, you can just see well, there's one of the isopods up there on top of the lily turf you can see the lily turf is just growing gorgeous and the spider plants are just taking off loads they're absolutely going mad in there so we're really happy with it. This is our view from above. Um, you can see, if you look closely, you can see some of the dairy cow ice pods under the bridge. They seem to really live, more or less live under that bridge at the moment. Um, and then we've um, just keep watching and you just see them all. There's that one that's uh, about to come out, but then I think they changed their mind. Um, but yeah, so they all seem to live mainly under the bridge, although we do see them obviously exploring the rest of the tank at other points in time. Um, we had to put a lid on the tank that um, the ice pods are in because we had a few escapees. They can survive so fully submerged underwater for up to an hour, um, but they we found once they'd made their way into the aquarium they can really get out, so um, we've just put this lid on now just to keep them safe. Um, you can see around here the little heart, the lily turf is just dwarfing it now. It's grown up absolutely lovely. Um, you can also see our spider plant there has just taken off. It's just gone mad. It's looking absolutely gorgeous there. Um, and then if you look over here, if I there is another spider plant. It's slightly smaller, but it is growing. Uh, just move the leaves there. You, it is growing nicely now. Um, and catching up slowly so we're really happy with how that's all looking at the moment um, and um, it's just well I just I'm just in love with it I love to adore this little setup here um, and then here you can kind of more see the lily turf in the that corner over there by the bridge 
and that's got really big as well and everything. And the ice pods love the leaf turf because obviously when leaves and that die, they they just easy. Here is a little clip of some of the dairy cow ice pods. Um, it's not the clearest. And I'm sorry about that, but um, we are filming through two panes of glass and obviously a lot of water um, to actually see them. But um, yeah, you can just see them all moving around. I seem really happy in there at the minute, so they seem to be doing nice, which is really good. <laughs> Thank you very much for watching, please like, comment and subscribe.